What is going on guys? Jack here and welcome to a Football Manager 2015 countdown. Today we're going to be counting down my personal top 5 approach to sign wonder kids at the start of any save as of the 15.3.0 update. If you enjoy the video smash the like button and if you think I've missed out any approach to sign players you can sign without having to make a transfer offer at the start of your saves, leave them down in the comments uh, for other people to check out. So without further ado, let's get started. The first player I have for you guys today is Malkamu Taufa. He is coming in at the number 5 spot. He's a good centre mid, particularly a good deep line playmaker with fantastic vision, teamwork and work rate for his age. He has some good passing as well as good marking and tackling, which as I mentioned lends himself very good uh, and very well to the deep line playmaker role. He can also play as a register and is capable of playing not only in centre mid but in defensive midfield. At the start of your save he is available for £700,000 compensation with a potential £1.1 million pounds compensation to be paid uh, in potential clauses and uh, I really recommend him. Fantastic player, um, good deep line playmaker and a, a definite must buy. He plays for Inter, uh, he's got an Italian nationality but he also has Ethiopian and he's a very good player and he also has the preferred move, comes deep to get the ball and at the price of just shy of £2 million pounds, he's a fantastic bargain at the start of any save. The next player in this countdown is Bilal Oud Cheek. Uh, he's a good player, comes in at the number 4 spot. He plays for FC Twente and he's available for around £2.2 .2 million in compensation when you factor in for additional clauses. He can play right attack in mid but is very versatile and is more than capable of being developed to play up front, any attack in midfield position or any midfield position. He's left footed and he's very good at cutting in on his left foot. He also has great dribbling and first touch for his age as well as some very very solid physicals and at 6 you've got plenty of time to kind of form him into the player that you want him to be. Uh, in terms of what else he has about him, he has the preferred move get forward whenever possible which means that he's a very very good attacking midfielder and he also has Morocco at second nationality. A good player, plenty of potential with this guy but because of his slightly higher price he only comes in at the number 4 spot. Coming in at the number 3 spot and grabbing the bronze medal here in this countdown, we have Luka Jovic. He plays for Red Star, 16 years old, a fantastic complete forward at a very, very young age. One of the downsides with him is that he does require a work permit and he won't join your club immediately, but nevertheless he's a fantastic player and is capable and able to be signed for £1.8 million at the start of any save. If you want to see how he develops, there'll be links down in the description for screenshots of all of the players in this countdown so you can see what they look like when they fully fulfil their potential. Luke is a great player, will be more than capable of playing in the Premier League and grabbing 20 goals of the season should you develop into his potential and because of his fantastic well-rounded stats he deservedly grabs the number three spot. In the number two spot we have here Federico Bonazzoli. This guy's a fantastic target man with some good natural aerial attributes. He's on loan at the start of a save so he won't be able to join you to the second season of your save but he's a fantastic player. He's a minus nine potential ability player and is available for 2.2 million pounds compensation. I really like this guy because he has such good mentals and he's also a very good target man. I've seen him develop into a top Premier League striker on a number of my saves and he's a very very solid player capable of being approached to sign as I already mentioned. He also has the preferred move attempt overhead kicks which comes in handy occasionally and looks absolutely fantastic when he rifles them into the top corner. And finally to round up this countdown I have for you guys in the number one spot John Arango. Now you may never have heard of this guy but he is a minus nine potential ability player. He's 16 years old plays in the attacking midfield position but can also play centre mid and he's a fantastic player. He's only 16 and he doesn't immediately get a work permit in game which may be troublesome if you're in England and he won't join your club for two years but the reason this guy's in the number one spot is because he's capable of being approached to signed with compensation of £5,000. I've seen him go to championship teams and he'll pretty much go to any team that can afford to pay his wages which he asks for peanuts. Recommended player really undervalued in game not many people know about him and for those reasons he grabs the number one spot because of his fantastic potential unknown quantity and also his fantastic ability and the fact he's an international player at the age of 16. Anyway guys hopefully you enjoyed this countdown I'll have some screenshots on screen showing you the potential of some of these players and how good they can become if you've enjoyed the video as I mentioned at the start smash the like button if we get 500 likes and we'll get another top 5 coming your way soon if you've got any recommendations for a future top 5 series leave them down in the comments other than that it is me Jack and I'll talk to you guys in a bit I'm out, and you jerk it out.